All right, so we've got some gems for you today, and not everybody can be the superstar, hence why we're starting off with Ramon Enriquez, who is specifically designed to sit on your bench. Um, as you can see, seven strength, he could get exterminated physically, but he's still got enough movement to evade the challenge, bro, that could end his career. And then technically, he's sound enough for the bench, and mentally, sound enough for the bench. Simple as, bro, what a player right there for the bench. All right, next we've got man like Arnau Pugmao, bro. So um, I remember this guy from my old Manchester United save. Um, yeah, it's a fact, bro. Well known fact. He's gone to Almeria now. Great club, bro. So yeah, he's a goal scoring midfielder by the stats. They're saying that he arrives late into the opponent's area. You look at the stats. He can. He, he's more than capable of bringing the cookies when they're needed, bro. Straight out of that oven late into that box bro and yeah 13 finishing it's good enough bro where's the long shots 12 yeah he's doing it for me still and then you look at the pass and he's good enough to create mentally 13s for a 21 year old i mean you can give him a little bit hey bruv give him a little bit of a pass you better believe it bro arrives late in yeah safe all right next we got my like joe skelly doing it for the american man then big up all the american man then man every single time you get me um Man is obviously chasing that first touch. The American text is real. I'm chatting rubbish. Um, yeah, chasing that first touch, bro. You can hear him in that American accent on the pitch, bro. That's why he's got all that work create and the determination, the aggression. You can hear, hear him saying, "Hey, come back, bro." That first touch. He's talking. To, he's talking to the ball at this point, bro. Man can't keep up with the ball. Um, that's why it says enthusiastic because he's always chasing it down, bro. And then, um, technically, there's nothing special here. I'll be honest. Physically is where it's at. Mentally, I believe it's the grip. I think that this guy, if I were to pick a position, straight on that bench. I'll be honest, bro. He's holding bench, but he's good enough for the future. I mean, this is pure prospect. This is pure potential, pure optimism. I'll be honest, bro. The guy is a right back, and I put him in this video because he's young, he's American, and I like him, bro. I think he's got a certain type of swag that I, I, I definitely mess with still. So he's in this gem, in this gem video right here. You get me? All right, the next player that we've got is my man, Adam Ida. Um, the reason why he's in this video right now, not only because of his age, but I've seen what he actually looks like after a couple of seasons. His physicals go straight through the roof, bro. So um, let's just put it like this, yeah. Right now, these are baby stats for him, for what he looks like in the future. So I'm saying you should sign him now so you can see what I'm talking about, bro. And just testament to what I'm saying, yeah. The guy has got a torn knee ligament injury. Who do you know get a get gets a torn knee ligament injury? Oh my god, bro! Gets a torn knee ligament injury and is only gone for one to three days, bro. That's not normal. That should take you out for a couple weeks, bro. But man's he he ate that literally. He ate, he's eating everything, bro. All the protein in the world, bro. Man, will chew off his own ligaments and chew them, chat rubbish. But yeah, good enough finishing. Um, good enough heading. He's one for the future. Yeah, a little gem right there. You might know about either anyway, man. Big up all. Big up, big up all the man then, bro. I didn't use the Twitch, I mean, the Discord chat today. I wanted to do it on my own. You get me? All right, next we've got man like Adrian Bernabe. So the guy's 21 um, and he just looks like a pair of safe hands in that midfield. He looks like he's got the technical ability to play in a ball retention system. He's got the versatility as well. He can play in a, uh, in a, in a number of positions as well. He just, bruv, literally, he's like that... Um, iPhone filter that you put on your phone so when people try and look at your phone they can't see what they're watching because you've put a black screen here you can kind of get those kind of things bro this isn't a promotion I'm literally saying like he's safety in it like no one can see you scrolling through all these Instagram girls um, because it's not their business that's your business bro. you can do whatever the hell you want and this is that kind of guy bro he just takes care of you in it like in that midfield I trust him to keep that ball I do stat wise he's got the ability to do it in it so um yeah, I'll, I'll probably leave it there still. What a player, bro. Um, Yeah, what's his name? I don't really give a damn, bro. All right, the next one that I've got, I can't believe I've got this many midfielders, bro. I didn't really think it through. Um, This one, he's kind of boring, I'll be honest, bro. I mean, it's good. It could be effective, but he's not doing anything exciting, I'll be honest. He's only 20, and he's mastering passing and dribbling. That's it. All he can do is receive the ball, dribble with it, and pass it that's all the stats are saying right now he's that he's, he's doing that at the ability of around 13s we don't know how well he will develop so i'll leave that to you to decide but obviously if he develops well that's a good player right there i believe that in a ball retention system he can definitely flourish happy mother's day all right next gem that i've got for you man like 21 year old alex mendez 
doing the American thing. I'm telling you, big up the American man. Them. I didn't know you lot had this in your locker. I'll be honest, bro. Um, he's obviously wanted. There's a reason for that. Let's not talk about who he's wanted by. It's not important. What I'm going to say is stat-wise, all he needs is a couple more Red Bulls, bro. Because right now, he's got the ability. He's actually got ability. That's the maddest thing. Like Technically, he's sound physically for the role that he's claiming. I don't really give a damn about it. All he needs is a bit more a bit more action in the mentals because right now he looks hella slow and lethargic. He looks like a literal bowl of porridge sitting on your dining table doing absolutely nothing mentally, bro. He doesn't look like he can be bothered to do anything. He's just slow and lazy. I'm not, I'm not talking about pace. His brain just doesn't move at the same pace as the other people on his team because, yeah, he just doesn't give a damn, bro. Stat-wise, just doesn't care. 10 work rate. Tell me everything I need to know. So yeah, that's what I'll say about man like Alex Mendes. Also, he needs to know like when and when, <laughs> where where to be, when to go, when to stay. That needs that needs work as well. I'm not gonna lie, he's got that shoot from distance trait and he can actually do it. That's a good player in potential. I'll be honest. All right, the next player that we've got is a 19 year old called Elia Wahi. Um, yeah, so he looks slightly above average for people his age. Like for the strikers, he looks like he's had a lot of experience. He looks like he's had a couple loans based on the stats. The only thing he can't do right now is link up play. Poacher roll is always available. Poacher roll, I've heard, is actually kind of broken. So if you put this guy as a poacher, he, he looks like he's doing a job. For me, I'm saying he's signable. If I need a striker or even a backup for a, great, for a greater team, I can sign that guy and I can be happy with that sign. I won't feel like I got robbed. You get me, man gave me my Happy Meal and forgot to put the toy in the bo box, bro. Robin the man them. Don't worry, we're not dealing with Robins over here. This is, you're getting fulfilled fully. You get me. All right, next we've got a 21-year-old called Daniel, or Daniel, Jesus. Just because man's from certain countries, I can't say his name in the way I say it. Yes, I can, bruv. Man like Daniel Peretz, bruv. Um, literally, for his age, all he's missing right now, in my opinion, He's a bit of agility, man. So all he needs is a bit of oil. I don't think he's... Bruv, I, I think he's going to go far, stat-wise. Like, literally, 15 reflexes, 9 agility, what, 30 one-on-ones. Very good on the ball. Like, the composure's good. I mean, the first touch is... It's, it's a calamity, bro. I'll be honest. That is terrible. Horrendous. But um, kicking 14, passing 13. He's got potential, bro. And as you can see, the throw-in. If you play out from the back of this guy, ask him to throw it. He can start a couple attacking charges. He's a good player. Um, all he needs is a bit of, like I've said, a bit of oil. It's not, it's not hard to find. Trust me. And the last gem that I've got for you this week for these kind of videos is Matteo Ruggeri. Yeah, so I'm um, playing for Atlanta right now. And as you can see, he's doing literally everything that you need right now at a decent enough level. For a 19-year-old, he is another one that I can say gladly. He's definitely above average for his age. Um, good natural fitness as well. Brilliant for that bedroom, as we always know. Um, crossing the ball early, he's doing that. So I'll probably do a fullback support, maybe wingback support. Good, good enough pace to do that, definitely. And the thing that I really like about this guy is the off the ball and the positioning are both 13. And he can pass the ball. Yeah, nah, I think it's a given star. I'll probably sign this guy. If I can get that for 10 million as a future prospect because he's only 19, yeah, you better sign me up right now. You get me? Have a good day.